Bitcoin BRC20 tokens, Ordinals, where do we trade them? Which platform actually do you use to trade? If this has been your question since the last time I started posting about Ordinals on Twitter and also on YouTube, then this video will help you guys to get started. I know the biggest problem here is that most of the Ordinal projects in BRC20 and DRC20 tokens are mostly traded on chain on all these weird new different on-chain platforms and these are not user-friendly basically very very difficult to use and there's so many of them and most people want one platform that they can use to trade everything to do with ordinals and i have been looking and i found it and in this video guys i will show you the platform that i have been using to trade brc20 tokens and drc20 tokens and all the ordinals stuff so let's get prepared my name is gray btc on behalf of crypto university i would like to thank you for watching and I would appreciate it if you subscribe to this channel and like the video and leave a comment. It will help us to grow at Crypto University. So let's get started on how to trade BRC20 tokens on this platform. So the platform that I'm talking about, guys, it's called CoinW.com. This is a crypto exchange that you can use. It's free to use. You can download the app. You can create an account. And the cool thing about it is that you don't need to complete KYC to use it. You can basically just create an account with your email address and phone number and immediately you start using it. So let me walk you through the process of creating an account first. But what I would recommend that you do also is that you try to use the link in the description when you're creating this account because it will give you a welcome bonus, all right? What I mean by that is when you go to register, you're going to, uh, you have to go using the link in the description, you go to the register, and then here you put all your information. Or alternatively, if you download the app on your mobile, what you should do is make sure you put the invitation code right here. There is a space here to put the invitation code and this is the invitation code you should use to make sure that you take advantage of my benefits. So you can simply use this invitation code, right? You will get um, uh, a, a, a rebate as well. And that code is 240-3917. If you use this number as your invitation code, you get all the benefits that comes with signing up with my link. You can also invite your friends, just like what I'm doing now, to get some rebates. All right. So once you have done that, you want to put to fund your account. So you see that you have a wallet feature here. You can go to Assets Overview and you're supposed to fund your account, all right? So typically you fund your account by going into the funding account deposits. And here you're supposed to basically uh, select the cryptocurrency you want to use to deposits. And you can also select the network that you want to use. So let's say you have Bitcoin or USDT and other exchanges like Binance, Coinbase, and what have you, other wallets, you use this tab to deposit everything. And once you deposit, the funds should show up here when you go to your assets overview. All right, so you can see here, I have $766 in this account. I just created this account recently for educational purposes. Uh, because like I said, because there's no KYC, you can have multiple accounts, but you need to have at least one account that's verified. I think it's very important. Okay, so now you can see in my overview, I have my money in the funding wallet. I also have some of them in the uh, uh, in other wallets, I think in the futures. There you go, I have some in the futures. Each wallet represents each trading category. So if you're trading spot ETF, because on CoinW, you can also trade ETFs, you click on ETF and you can move your funds around into these different wallets for free. But let's get to the business of Ordinals here. If you go to markets, all right, these are markets, and you can see here, it says hot, it says futures, top gainers, and different kind of way of categorizing these coins. 
the most important part for me that I like is if you go to heart, you have BRC20 and it shows you the entire list of BRC20s here that are listed here and the prices that are trading on. And you can also switch to DRC20. These are Dogecoin based currencies. And here you've got all the Solana ones. And here you've got meme coins. Like it's a lot of meme coins that uh, you might otherwise wouldn't have been, been able to find them on other exchanges. Like these are not easy to get because most of them are not on Binance just yet. You find early cryptos using this platform and this is the feature I use. So let's say I want to trade some rats. I'll just click on rats and I want to buy some rats and you'll see that it's taking me to the trading desk where I can put a buy order, spot or futures. So here I'm at spot, which means I'm buying a spot. If you want to switch to leverage, you can click on futures right here on your right. It's very simple and straightforward, very, very effective, um, intuitive platform. I like how the design works. Okay, so you can see here I have a, an Ethereum perpetual trade, uh, which is at a profit of $93 and 89% ROI, which I think is really cool. But um, I want to buy rats, so I can simply either just type it right here, rats. And this is a perpetual market again. But if I want to, if you just want to buy a spot, you can always go back to trade at the top and click on spot. You can do this on mobile as well. So let's buy some rats because rats, I think, has gone down a bit. It might come back. We might see it pumping very soon. So this is a spot position for rats. All right. So for rats, I would just say buy, I want to buy $100 worth of rats as an example. But you can see at the bottom here showing me that I have zero USDT available. But in my wallet overview, it showed that I should have 600. What's going on? It's because the funds are in a funding wallet. I'm supposed to transfer them over into my trading wallet which is good because this is how the exchange keeps your funds separated and safe instead of mixing them all up. So I'll click these three dots right here and go to transfer. And on transfer, I will, let's say, I want to move $300 into my trading account and then I'll click transfer from funding to spot account, transfer, all right? And then I shall put in my order of 100 bucks on some rats. So I want to enter at the buying price of this. If you want to select the buying price, you can just click any of these numbers here on the green or on the red, it's buyer, buyers and sellers. Most importantly, the one that's at the top here. And I want to spare, or you can slide this to select the amount you want, but simply I just like to type in the amount of USDT I want to buy. And then I click on buy rats. This is a limit order. It's going to be waiting here until it gets filled. If you want to buy very quickly, you just go on market order. You type, let's say you want to buy for 50 bucks, type buy, and that has already been filled. Easy. But what if you want to short a BRC20 token? Can you do that? Yeah, you can. This is what I do. So I will go to futures, click up top there. And on futures, I shall select, let's say I want to short Audi. I'm like, okay, Audi might go down by 5%. Maybe it might go back to $70 from 73. How do I do that? I'll go here. And I'll set up, let's say, a market order to enter right now. And I want to put 50% of my money on shorting OI. And I can also select my take profit. Let's say I'm thinking take profit. It's a quick trade um, within, and it's a, based on a five minute time frame or 15 minute. I think it will go down to $70. Or if it goes up to like 74, I want. To exit the market all right 
what is the leverage position you can select leverage here on the top right leverage is currently at 20x but i want to reduce it to like 10x and um, margin mode i'll choose isolated margin i just prefer that and size i've already selected 50 percent and then i'll just go sell short and we now have an order position short with take profit and stop loss set up that's basically how easy it is to use this platform so a lot of exchanges don't list ordinals but this platform literally lists a lot of them much faster than most of the exchanges and you can start trading them here quicker before a lot of people get in so I hope that helps you guys. Um, I'll, I'll make more tutorials on how to use this platform and I'll create a portfolio on BRC20 on CoinW so that you guys can learn and also can be able to follow my trades. If you want to follow my trades on CoinW, I'll put the link in the description for copy trading so that if you want to copy me, you can simply click a button and copy it. All right. I would appreciate it if you subscribe to Crypto University for more educational content otherwise see you guys next time good luck if you have any questions comments below stay awesome